I mean, we all are healers and we're all psychics. Do we say hi, British Vogue, same time? Hi, hi British, British Vogue. Vogue. It's Paloma. I'm Precious. And today we are playing a game of Never, Never Have, Have I, I Ever. ever. <laughs> Never. <laughs> Is your paddle warmed up? Never have I ever snooped through someone's phone. I mean, okay, it literally was once. Not literally once. Really? <laughs> Ow. I'm not a big phone phone swooper, but in every relationship, if it passes me by, it might happen. You know what it is? It's not a text, too. It's like, oops, oh my gosh, your computer's open. And all your iMessages just came up. Oh my God, what just happened? <laughs> <laughs> like, it's like that. Never have I ever tripped on a catwalk. <laughs> I just literally have the instance in my head and I was surfing. I was like, shoulders back, pop, pop. I own everything. Uh, I've fallen. <laughs> Full to the knees. Forward? Forward, down, boots. You kind of have to shrug it off and keep it pushing. Okay. Never have I ever ghosted someone. I'm not a ghoster. Are you? But not? it happens, no. It is definitely a tool of avoidance. I honor my feelings when I do not want to be bothered. Have I ever ghosted you? No. Oh, I thought we were talking about boys. Oh. <laughs> okay, I'm doing a little swirl. Never have I ever sent a racy text to the wrong person. No, I'm a Virgo. I would never do that. This is kind of fun. <laughs> never have I ever seriously regretted an outfit. Yeah. I commit, though, when I walk out the door. I have regretted many outfits, but you learn each time. Because then a lot of the outfits that I now regret are ones that I was like, oh, this is very fab in the moment. At certain eras. I was in a chola era. I was in a very provocative moment era. I was in, like, is that a man era? None of them are regrettable. It's just like, I guess it culminates now into this. <laughs> Paddles ready. Never have I ever met my celebrity crush. Never? Never. Who's your celebrity crush? Uh-uh. You, you must. I am 100% not doing that. Who's my celebrity crush? Oh my god. Because I just met Lenny Kravitz. <gasps> but it was it's more like celebrity crush slash icon. Like, it's not that I particularly want to kiss. It's that I particularly want to hang. Are you sure? Never have I ever gone to a psychic. I call it like an intuitive. I grew up in a very, very overly spiritual household. Getting a chart read, someone who communicates with people who have crossed over. I recently spoke to one and my grandpa was in the building, so it's fab. Like I'm the person that thinks like if you're walking past like a psychic place and something about it's pulling you towards it, then go in and sit down and have a reading. I love intuitives. Like I know an amazing intuitive in England and she's fab. Honestly, she's no, she's nail. like coming to my wedding like that. Yeah. She's fam. On that note, thank you for watching. Hope you learned something about Precious and Paloma. I'm probably not gonna go through your text, I promise. <laughs>